Now this is your electronic shift mechanism located in all BMWs with the exclusion of the 2016 X1. Now this shift mechanism may be a little different from what you're used to in the sense that this is an electronic shift versus a mechanical shift where you have to physically pull the lever back to reverse, neutral, and drive. In this case, all you have to do is simply hold the unlock button on the side located right here and then pull back. Now we're in drive. Now speaking of the unlock button located on the left side of the shift mechanism, the only time you have to hold this button down is when taking it out of park or putting it into reverse. Now while in drive, you do have your MS mode or your manual sequential mode that branches off to the left of drive. Now in order to access that, you'll just simply press over to the left. From here, you can upshift and downshift to your liking by either pressing forward or pulling back. And finally, you have your park button, which you can press anytime as long as you're stopped and any gear. Now, as we move behind your shift mechanism, you have your parking brake. Now, the parking brake includes the same functionality as the manual crank that used to be right here. Simply just pull up to engage and push down to disengage, like so. Pull up, the little red light comes on, signifying that it's engaged, and then you push down to then disengage. Now, behind your parking brake, you have your auto hold. This system assists the driver by automatically setting and releasing the brake, such as when moving and stop and go traffic. So essentially, when you come to a complete stop, the auto H or auto hold is going to temporarily engage, thus allowing you to remove your foot from the brake and keeping the car stationary. Once you move your foot from the brake to the accelerator, the car will then disengage the parking brake, allowing you to continue forward. This system is going to keep engaging and disengaging the parking brake however many times you would like it to until you press auto H to disengage the feature as a whole. 